Alright, so we're going to learn how to make some plots, or multiple plots on one graph in Maple. Alright, so the first command you should put in your worksheet is you should hit uh, restart. And then I'm going to just type in, I've typed in just some generic differential equation. In this case, I don't really care what it is. Let me make that a little bit bigger so that you can see it. There we go. So there's my differential equation. So can you solve this? I go, yes, you can. If you right click on it and come down here to solve interactively, that's what you want to do. So right click on it and click solve interactively and you'll see a window that looks like this. All right, so now you got to put our initial conditions in. The problems you're asking me doing is an initial at, at, at the function of y at x equals 0 needs to be equal to a, so I'm going to add that. And then the derivative of the function of y at x equals 0 has to be equal to b. And I'm going to add that. And then I'm, I'm done. So I have my two uh, conditions. I just don't know what they are. I want it to solve that, so I'm going to tell it to solve symbolically. And then I'm going to click Solve Symbolically here, and there's my solution. To get that out, I just hit quit, quit, and out comes my function right here. All right, so um, I should say, here's my solution to my differential equation. And it's right down here also. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to assign B. So I assign B, and then I'm going to look at my equation 3 again, which is up here. And if you look at this, what it's done is I've assigned B equal to 1. And if I make this bigger, you can see that now the everywhere, everywhere there's the B up here is now put into a 1. And this is the function I want to plot. So to plot this function, here's what you want to do. You want to type plot and then parentheses square bracket right hand side of this equation. In my case, it's equation 5. I can see it right here. Equation 5 is right here. And then uh, my parameter is A, so I want to do uh, close parentheses, dollar sign. So to get this 5 in here, I have to hit control L and type 5 and hit return. And then I hit the dollar sign. And then A equals minus 5 dot dot 5 close square brackets, comma. Uh, I know A is supposed to be my initial condition, so uh, I want to see where uh, these are. So my x-axis is I'm going to go, I didn't really know it was minus 5 to 5. I, I did minus 10 to 10. I did y minus 10 to 10. But then I found out that was x at minus 10 to 10 was too big, so I chose minus 5 to 5. And you can see all the solutions. You can see every initial condition the function has to go through that initial condition there. So, so here's uh, initial condition equal 5, initial condition equal 4, 3, 2, 1, 0, minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, minus 4, minus 5. Because that's what this does. It sets 5, uh, sets A equal to minus 5 through 5, and it creates functions where it just puts that in there and creates these uh, 11 functions here that plot it out right here. All right. So... Uh, that's one graph they want you to produce. Um, and now I need to unassign uh, B because I want my original function back. Because uh, if I blow that up, you can see now that my the B is back. And I want to assign A. So I assign my A, and I write out the function again. And if you look at this function, if I make it a little bit bigger, it should be here. Now, all the B's are there, uh, but the A's are gone. So now what I want to do is do another plot command, and I only want the right-hand side of equation 8 over here. And to get equation 8 in there, you hit Control-L. That's on a PC. I think the um, Apple is Command-L. I'm not 100% sure you want to check the help for that. If you click Help here, go down to Maple. So... I'll make the plot, and, but this time I want it to change B. And now if you look at the graph, you can see that uh, uh, the A 
is specified as one, and that's the initial condition. You can see every solution goes to one now instead of that. But the slopes of the graphs are all changing. The slopes start out at uh, minus 5 and go to 5. And then the last command is I unassign A, so now I can get my, my function back. But that's how you make a plot.